to solve the equation x square minus x cube equal to 12. Let's write this expression to the right hand side. So we have 0 equal to x cube minus x square plus 12. Or we can say x cube minus x square plus 12 equal to 0. Further, we can simply write it as x square into x minus 1 plus 12 equal to 0. Observe that x equal to 1 is not a solution of this equation. x equal to 2 is also not a solution of equation. x equal to 3? No. What about x equal to minus 1? No. Minus 2? Yes, minus 2 squared is 4. 4 into minus 3 is minus 12. Minus 12 plus 12 is 0. Therefore, x equal to minus 2 is a solution. Now, we know that if x equal to a is a solution, then x minus a is a factor. Therefore, x plus 2 is a factor of x cube minus x square plus 12. So we write x cube minus x square plus 12 is, we know that x plus 2 is a factor, so let's add plus 2x square. So from here we'll get x plus 2 as a factor. But we have minus x square, so we need to add just it. So plus 2 minus 3 x square, we'll get it minus x square. Then we want x plus 2 to be a factor, so we add uh, 6x. Now we subtract 6x, then we'll get x plus 2 as a factor from this quantity as well. Now, if we have subtracted 6x, we don't have any term involving x here, so we have to add 6x plus 12 as it is, and that's equal to 0. Now, let's take x plus 2 common from each of this expression, each of these three expression. So, we obtain x square common. First step, we take x square common, we get x plus 2 here. We take minus 3x common, again we get x plus 2. And lastly we take 6 common, we again get x plus 2. Now we take x plus 2 common throughout. So we have x plus 2 whole thing into x square minus 3x plus 6 equal to 0. As we said earlier, if minus 2 is a root of this equation, then this polynomial x square, x, sorry, x cube minus x square plus 12 must have a factor x plus 2. Now, we observe that product of two number is 0. Once we know that this product is 0, one of them has to be 0. Maybe both of them are 0, but at least one of them has to be 0. So we obtain x plus 2 equal to 0, or maybe both of them are 0 x square minus 3x plus 6 equal to 0. Whenever x plus 2 equal to 0, then we have x equal to minus 2. What about this equation? This is a quadratic equation. Roots are given by. Uh, let's compare it with the expression ax square plus ax square plus bx plus c equal to 0. Then roots are given by x equal to minus b plus minus root over b square minus 4ac by 2a. Here a equal to 1, b equal to minus 3, so minus of minus 3 is plus 3 plus minus root over minus 3 whole square is 9 minus 4 into a is 1, c is 6. That's equal to oh, 2 into a. That's equal to uh, 3 plus minus 9 minus 24. 9 minus 24 is 3 plus minus root minus 15 by 2. 
Of course, uh, we can write it as 3 plus minus root 15i by 2. So the solution of the equation are given by x equal to minus 2, comma x equal to 3 plus root 15i by 2, comma x equal to 3 minus root 15i by 2. And we are done.